Today, we are exploring an often overlooked but crucial aspect of your computer's health and performance, the temperature of your graphics processing unit or GPU. Whether you're pushing the limits with the latest game or rendering complex 3D models, GPU is a powerhouse of your computer. But with great power comes great responsibility, and that includes keeping an eye on its temperature. What is a good temperature for your GPU? Why does it matter if it gets too hot? And what are the risks of overheating? More importantly, how can you monitor and maintain the optimal temperature? In this video, we'll answer all these questions. We'll delve into to the ideal temperature range for NVIDIA and the AMD graphics card during different tasks and show you how to effectively monitor and manage these temperatures to ensure your system runs smoothly and reliably. Understanding and managing your GPU's temperature isn't just about prolonging its lifespan. It's about unlocking its full potential while ensuring your entire system remains healthy and efficient. Graphics processing units are the heart of visual computing. They heat up based on workload, and managing their temperature is crucial for performance and longevity. The normal operating range refers to the optimal temperature range in which a GPU functions effectively and safely. Under standard operating conditions, this range is usually between 60 and 80 degrees Celsius. Maintaining a GPU's temperature within these limits ensures efficient performance while preventing overheating, which could lead to hardware damage or reduced lifespan. Different tasks such as video editing, 3D rendering, and gaming, the normal and dangerous GPU temperature ranges vary, depending on the GPU brand and model. In this video, we will discuss the two most popular GPU brands, NVIDIA and AMD. Modern NVIDIA graphics cards should stay below 85 degrees Celsius for safe operation, with some models capable of exceeding this slightly before hitting their maximum temperatures. For the latest RTX 30 and 40 series NVIDIA cards, the generally accepted safe maximum temperature is below 93 degrees Celsius. At this temperature, the RTX 30 series GPUs begin to throttle their performance as a measure to prevent overheating. For NVIDIA cards, temperatures in the 95 to 100 degrees Celsius are considered dangerously high, leading to performance throttling to prevent damage and maintain safe operation. When gaming, it's recommended to maintain a baseline temperature below 80 degrees Celsius for NVIDIA cards. This offers a safety margin below the maximum threshold If we talk about AMD cards, modern AMD units should be kept below 95 degrees Celsius under full load, although the most recent models can handle up to 110 degrees Celsius. However, these are considered safe limits, not recommended operating temperatures. 110 degrees Celsius is the official maximum temperatures. Consistently exceeding 90 degrees Celsius for extended periods can be detrimental to the graphics card lifespan. Entering the 100 degrees Celsius and above range is considered critically dangerous and should be avoided at all costs. For gaming on an AMD GPU, aiming for an ideal temperature between 65 to 80 degrees Celsius is recommended. This range provides a good balance between performance and longevity. Here's a breakdown of the temperature ranges for AMD graphics cards. Now that you understand the various temperature ranges for cards, including what's safe and what could be harmful for your NVIDIA or AMD graphics card, the main question arises, how can you check and monitor your GPU's temperature to ensure it stays within the safe limit? Checking your GPU temperature is a straightforward process. Simply install the HWinfo tool on your computer to get started. Visit the official HWinfo website and download the latest version of the software compatible with your operating system. Run the downloaded installer and follow the on-screen instructions to install HW Info on your computer. Open the HW Info application. You may choose between sensors only and summary only modes. Select the sensors only for detailed hardware monitoring. In the HW Info Sensors window, scroll through the list to find your GPU. 
you will see multiple readings related to your GPU, including temperatures. Look for values labeled as TPU temperatures or similar. This will show the current temperature of your GPU. HW Info updates these readings in real time. Compare the temperature readings you see with the safe temperature ranges for your specific NVIDIA or a MD GPU model.